Got a minute? Let's talk about... Well, we'll try and keep up. Tenet is not good. I mean, it's it's good from a technical standpoint, and it features good performances from Washington, Pattinson, and Debicki, and there are good action and visual effects sequences, but the rest is... Uh, particularly the story, which is needlessly convoluted and not nearly as clever as it seems to think it is. Without spoiling anything, each of the three main characters gets their own twist, none of which were particularly shocking or interesting. You can almost imagine Nolan sitting in the back row of the theater thinking, their minds should be blown by now. And worst of all is Tenet's bad guy. Even the worst movies in the James Bond franchise, which Nolan has cited as a major influence on Tenet, have better antagonists than this. And again, I can't say much without spoiling, but the villain's plan can be and is in the film entirely summed up with a terrible stock phrase. It's one of the few times in my life I can remember hoping for a trope to be lampshaded, but it never is. And there's still plenty of big screen spectacle here, some of which is worth checking out, but while I appreciate the effort, I don't think this is the movie that's going to save cinema. That torch may have just passed to James Bond.